And it was a full day of anticipation for many in Franklin County in the middle of waiting to see what Hurricane Sally would bring to the Forgotten Coast. Some RVers shared their thoughts with ABC 27's Jada Williams. Waiting out whatever a storm may bring. It was a nail biter. Kept Dennis Hefner on high alert all day long. Hefner manages whole home RV park in Lanark Village. Usually packed with travelers, the threat of severe weather can change that quickly. They hear hurricane, they think, oh my goodness, I, I have to cancel my reservation. Early impacts from Sally sent trees crashing down. It also washed out Alligator Point Road, a road that's prone to flooding. Despite uncertainty from the storm, many are sticking around at Whole Home RV Park, all to get that front row view. <laughs> it's crazy. <laughs> crazy. This morning, this morning it was it was crashing up in front of the motor home. You know, we, we took a couple of pictures and sent back to relatives and friends to show them what it was like, you know. It's exciting. You get to go wherever you're going and say, I went through a hurricane. It was breathtaking. Hefner will evacuate the park if conditions start to worsen. Still, he believes the calm before the storm is a sight to behold. It's electrifying. It just kind of makes you, wow, understand the power of it all. In Franklin County, Jada Williams, ABC 27. And just to be safe, schools are closed in Franklin County tomorrow. Deputies continue to patrol the area looking for any damage.